to advertise with us, donate sponsorships and suggestions. Email us at trendafricatv at gmail.com or call us on 773-312-0318 or 773-756-6678. Remember to also follow and like us at Trend Africa TV on Facebook so you can always catch us live. On Instagram as Trend Africa TV 123 or subscribe to our YouTube channel as Trend Africa TV and click on the notification button to watch previous shows. You can also visit our website for your African news, entertainment, fashion and sports updates on www.trendafricaonline.net. Trend Africa TV, redefining Africa. It's your boy Royal Black Jesus, aka RBJ. Today we have in the building one of the Chicago own, one of the Alpha and Omegas who actually start the game here in Chicago. We're gonna rub some shoulders today, yeah, uh, with the one and only Mobit, the original banger in the building with me today, yeah. <laughs> So don't go nowhere, stay tuned, on. Um, hanging in there today, we will rub some shoulders. I mean, we're going to talk about the life of this young man and also the amazing project that he actually dropped like, uh, about a week ago, the, uh, the, uh, the EP that, I mean, is making noise all over to, uh, all over around the world. I was, I mean, I'm so honored to have this young man on board so that we can rub some shoulders. It's nobody but the original Mobit, the original banger. What's up, bro? What's going on, man? Uh, what's up? What's up, Black Jesus? How you doing? Man, <laughs> this is this is it's amazing. Man, you looking good, though. Thank you, thank oh, you. Oh, why you looking good, man? <laughs> start on the B rough. Tell <laughs> <laughs> tell tell us. I mean, tell my fans about who who is Mo when we say. Mobit, oh, I mean, uh, uh, Banger. Who is Banger? Who is Mobit Banger, man? Mobit Banger is, is a young person at heart that um, loves music. He's a music lover and has been following music since um, primary school. I went to Master Report. Shout out to Master Report. You know, um, since Master Report, I've always liked music. And um, my parents moved to the States, so I moved with them. And then in that process, I got exposed to the culture dynamics and all those things happening. That it was a culture shock because I see Mexicans, I see Arabs, I see different, like different um, Africans, like Nigerian, mm -hmm. other people. And with that being said, I was exposed to their music, and then. I started, you know, infusing all those things together, you know, to make my own stuff and create my own type of music. So, you know, Moby is a music genius. He's a sound genius. He's a friend. He's a brother. You never know. I'm an experience. So, that's you know, before we go to the the main the main dish, I mean, the main journey, you know, mm -hmm. I heard a lot of stories about you. I mean, 
you know, you oh. started uh, doing beats and things like that. And mm -hmm. and and one of your buddies actually uh, 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 gave me a little bit yourself about the closet. Man, tell me the story about the closet, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So the closet. I think that's my initial stages in the state. Um, I've always wanted to be a producer, so I had FL Studio, and I was producing my own. Beat. But the thing is, I didn't have artists that I would, you know, work with. So I had friends, and these friends like music. They can sing a key or two. So what I did was, I'll put everybody on my music. That way we can create a community of the new sound type right. of music, you know, in my era or in my peers or whatnot. And in that happening, we needed a studio. I didn't have a studio. So I had a, a closet. You know, in America, we have a little white closet they can open plus an apartment. So I take right. every part of my closet and I put the microphone in there. I bought a microphone, shout out to Young Vim. We bought a microphone, we bought um, speakers, we bought a mixer board. So now the closet was the booth. So people would go in and I'll close it. <laughs> so, you know, when you're in there and you're, you're uh, rapping or whatever, nobody will hear you that much or whatever, you know what I'm saying? It was, so that's that little closet part. And that's what we always used to record. That's what we recorded um, New Breed, the New Breed CD. Mm -hmm. Yeah, with Young Man, Mo, SBW, A Mo, um, George, Abid, Be Nice, uh, Mike Bonsu. Yeah, Mike Bonsu. 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 Yeah, email. He was on there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So wow. I like everybody in there. So that's 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 actually the, the classic project. That's what I call it. The new breed project project. So and, that's, and, that's and how and you guys have, have a, 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 so when did Nima vibe and all this thing came up came about? When? That was after. Nima vibes was the movement that was between more SW and I think come out. You know. And it was something that there was, there was a movement, you know, to start promoting um, party, you know, and, and all those things were just a, 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 like us branching out and doing our own things that we also have as entities. You know, and so it was just a part of the movement. Wow. Yeah, at that time. Man, my and brother, then, you've, you've come a long way. Yeah. You've come a, yeah. I, 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 I remember those days when I, I'll see all these young child and then. I mean, doing their thing, I was like, wow. I mean, this is amazing. And it's, it, it, so are you going to say that you guys were the first people who actually, um, you know, started music or make, uh, uh, doing the uh, Afrobeat or maybe the RMP, whatever that you call it, uh, here in the United States? I think, like I said, it was our back. Because every batch has what they bring, you know. And I think way before us was Damboy D, there was um, Abi Mensa, there was Pat Thomas, and there was um, Ben Falkman, you know. Okay. Alus, you know, and other people that I might not have known, but right. they did their part. And then I can only talk for my part because I was like hands on. Yeah, they are also, like I said, they, they are more like they are lifetime and things like that. But when the. The hip okay. life breakout. Uh, are you gonna okay. say that you guys were yeah. the first people that actually uh, 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 paved the way for people around the uh, United States? In a way, Chicago was always on top. Yeah. Because anytime that we contacted other people like Nana NYC, Rag Bobo, and other people from other states, we knew that our stuff was of good quality because we had content. So yes, I believe that. And I think that the EP or the album that we dropped sums everything up because it says new breed. So like we are saying, it was a new breed of different th things that are going to happen. Right. And in, 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 in so doing, it, it got us to be able to differentiate from just saying it's music. Now we're saying we have a dancehall artist. We have an Afrobeat artist. Right. Now we have a rapper, you know, Young Vim. Now we have other rappers anymore. We have producers. We have other people like um, that. Um, oh, Siza. Okay. Perp Man. Right? Perp his name Man. is Siza. Yeah. Shout out to Perp Man. You know, there's Black Up. 
that's Reason, that's Mo SBW, that's Emil, that's um, Cambodia. Cambodia, okay. I used to say. Okay. Uh, <laughs> George. George had a, he had just one verse on, the, on one of the songs. Are you talking about yeah. um, our George? So or... Right. So there's, there's Luna Rice George, right? And then there's George Cooper. So right. both of them were all on it, all on the same EP. You know? And I think, yeah, that's the best I can remember. Yeah, before the next batch two came, you know? But yeah. So you mean the, um, the main Uno, like the, the main, um, I call, you know, remember I used to call it the pop daddy of, uh, I mean, I call it pop daddy because you are, you are the guy behind the, the scene. Nobody sees you, but um, according to what I heard, you are the main guy. Like, are you, are, are, do, 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 do you cement that? Are you, do, 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 are you going to take that? Are you, are, you, I mean, you, uh, without you, there's no movement. Um, I wouldn't say that. I would say I'll, I'm consistent with what I do. Mm. So people will connect with that and say you're the guy because they see you moving, you know. But I think other people move in their own pace as much as they could, you know what I'm saying? So I think if consistency makes you the guy, then I was the guy, and I'm always the guy. And for me, I think you are the guy. I mean, I think you, 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 you I mean, for me, I think that you, 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 you the, um, the main root of this movement. And uh, I, I really applaud you and I respect you for that. And uh, you've, 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 you've done well. You've done so well, man. Bringing a lot of uh, beats and things like that. I, I mean, let's talk about, I mean, I know there's, there's, a, there's a project, there's, a, uh, there's something that we, there's something big that we want to talk about and we'll play some of the songs and things like that. But um, you working with the likes of VVIP, Reggie Rockstone, uh, Shatawale, I mean, you've worked with all these guys. What are some of the experience? I mean, how do you feel? I feel, I feel, you know, accomplished that, like, I have a list on my phone, right, that I, I write down, or I go, ch I, so I wrote it down, like, five years ago, and I take it off every year. I write a number of people that I want to work with, right, and some way, somehow, it happens. So working with them was like, wow, okay, cool, now I know that something is moving, I know that what I'm doing is moving, because sometimes in music, you feel like nothing's happening. Mm. Because the sound that you have is not what is popping now. But that doesn't mean that stuff is your thing, you know. So with, with that being said, you know, getting a chance to work with other people apart from who I always work with is always, you know, like cheerful. I'm I'm always happy about that. You know what I'm saying? So when the, news, was, when the news when the news break out that Mobit, the best uh, sound engineer something something award and I mean, that was a big thing. It was, I mean, it was a big thing. In Ghana, man, man God, that means you are, you, you are Uno now. You are the real Uno now. Yeah. When, you, when you heard the news, how, how, how was the feeling? Like, like, I was shocked because I was actually right here. And then I got a call. And the call was like, hey, Mo, you have been nominated for Best Producer of the Year. I'm like, what? He's like, yeah. I'm like, I haven't submitted anything. Because I know you have to submit, right? Apparently, it was submitted because, I mean, it was it was picked because the same song won, or no, not won, the same song had more than three categories. It had five categories. Okay. So automatically, they had to put the producer on there. So I didn't know anything about it. I was just there and I got a call like, you're on it. I'm like, what? It was like, I don't know. It was like a dream come true. It's like, oh, finally, I get to... Your hard work, right? I've got that feeling, yeah. Working hard. Some, I mean, so, somebody yep, yep, recognize yep. you somehow. Oh, wow. Really? Because it's hard. It's very hard to break you being a diaspora producer, to mm. break and be on Ghana Music Awards. Yeah. They're not going... It's not like they will not, they will not allow it, but... Yeah. It's hard. It's like... It's a process. Yeah. They have to understand what you're doing. And 
I think my frequent coming to Africa and listening to different sounds is what got me to to fall right in in time and in place with what was happening at that point in time. Mm. Because if you know how, let's say ninety five or before ninety five, uh, if there was hip hop, who we'll hear it a month later? That's right. Here in Ghana, right? That's right. Or let's say in the States, right? If there's a new song, we don't get it because uh, because of probably internet. We didn't have that much internet because before we get it, so like before we would get the song, it would have been out of the time. Right. And then we right. start making music around that time, thinking that that's the right thing to do because it was a hit. But what we didn't know was that music is dynamic and it keeps changing. Mm. And you never know what will happen. You know, so I think my frequent moving around, trying to, you know, hear different sounds is what got me riding into that time to produce that type of beat. And, you know, you know like, I, 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 I really enjoy, um, um, I mean, when, we, when we're talking about music, I really enjoy talking to you when it comes to things like that. Because you know me, I love music. I, I am, and every time when you drop something, the first person you, like, man, I got to hit Black Jesus up, right? Quick. Because, you know, I have, I, I have some, some intellectual, uh, uh, you know, hearing, be, you know. So, um, at one point, you change the whole, your own, everything, the rhythm. I mean, the, 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 your, your style of producing, everything. And, and people didn't understand where you are coming from. But the same, the same style of rhythm uh, got you nominated, right? So, what, what, what? Why, why that change? What did you see? I, I think I got to a point where I was like, it's not just about producing. Mm. Because it was, I got to a point, I always thought like, okay, cool. JQ King. I played this game. Everybody has a time limit. But there's one person I always respect, which is like, uh, what's his name? Hama. Hama would do his stuff. And he'll wait till a couple of years and come out with new artists and new everything. And it will always give you a sense of rejuvenation. By the same time, you know, it's Hama, mm -hmm. you know, and that was a nice, I would say a, a nice skill that he had. Now, my other mentors are like Timberland, Pharrell, Susby, and they also have that wow effect whereby they can come anytime and you want to go and listen because they produce it. Now, for that to happen, you as a producer have to see yourself as an artist in producer, not an artist singing. Because mm. if you see yourself as an artist in producing, then you are giving yourself the chance to evolve. Because you know that even as a rapper, your next track got to be harder than the old one you did. So with that being said, my next beat got to be harder than the, the hit I did. So I have to challenge myself every day. And in challenging myself, I have to bend the rules. I have to do something way away from um, what everybody thinks, um, let's say, Afrobeat was, or high life music, or um, hip life music was. You know, I had to put myself in in a place whereby it's going to be my lifestyle. Wherever I go, I hear different sounds. And even when I'm sitting down, I, I hear sounds in my head that will make me go and produce. So with that, I started fusing those things together. And in fusing, not everybody else will understand where you're going or catch on to it. But when you work with real musicians, right, they correct the fault by using their vocals. Right. Or they connect with the fault anyway, because if you listen to, um, let's say, house music from Essie, you'd be like, what? maybe you will not catch it the first time you listen to it. It will sound a lot of things to you. Mm -hmm. But when you sit out and you listen to it again and listen to the instrumentation and how they come in at what time and why they are all at the same time, it makes you get it like you can visualize it. Right. Now, my production became more of visualizing. I wanted an artist to hear the beats and already see themselves somewhere. 
with the song already. So when you're making it, it's easier because the words just flow. You find yourself somewhere way away from where you, are, where you always are. And in a way, whoever I produce for, it got them better. Because I was challenging them as much as they are challenging me. Mm. If I work with you, if I work with, let's say, Manifest. Now, I know his, his intellect and how he will be on a beat. I wouldn't give him a beat that is okay. I'll give him a beat that will, like, challenge him, you know, to come out with something so, like, crazy that somebody will be like, yo, for him to be able to go around this beat, alone makes it better. So with that being said, I started thinking we ahead of time. And I want my my dream or some of my dreams and my patients is is to be notified for the best of what I'm doing. Which right. is Bonnie, Amy and everything bigger than what might be there. Because I believe that I can push myself way outside of the box than I did, let's see 10 years ago, and I want to keep pushing myself and I want to keep, you know, putting myself in that manner. You know, so with that being said, that is why my beat changed. Wow, wow. That is a, that, that, that's the story right there. I mean, uh, I, I was one of the few people that really understand where you are coming from and things like that because you want to infuse the, the African culture style of, I mean, there's a whole lot of things that you, you did that people were not were bashing you here and there. Oh, what be done? Did not did not say? Oh, Nisa 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 Oh, but um, you you did well. You did well. I'm so proud of you. I will take a musical break when we come back. We'll dive into now. You've you've talked about the pro, pro, the, the being a producer side and then uh, uh, doing. But he finished. Let me add the last one. Please. You know, I work with other other other, other um artists. I work with Chase. Okay. The Nigerian artist, I right. work with Chip. And then I work with Jashanti. Okay. Right. You work with like, OSB, though. I mean, I didn't want to... I mean, right. I, I mentioned them, but I didn't mention um, these two because I, I thought we were still at the closet side. We didn't come back to, you know, me getting the studio and other things. So. Uh, <laughs> I know the because of time. Because of time. I mean, okay. we, we have to... So I put I it in there. We have to invite you for a special... Moby time, so that we talk about Moby. I mean, from day one, yeah. from Ghana to here, from the closet to, I mean, uh, the likes of, uh, uh, I mean, those who <laughs> retired. I mean, the, the, yeah. some of them said they've retired. I don't even know what they did and they've retired. So we we'll have to talk about all that, and I'm trying to bring them all back, you know. But yeah, um, right. I mean, you've done well. You are, you are the uno. I mean, when I say you are the uno, you know what I'm talking about. You are the head, and and all these people uh, will come. But uh, when you I mean, I, I you know I don't want to go there, but Mobit as producer switch to I mean you still do producing. Yeah, but, I, I um, still do. Let, let's talk about being producer and doing music at the same time. Uh, it, it, do you think it's it, it's it's like um um uh, there's a saying? What is that? Um, um, oh, I forgot to say. Conflict of interest. No, 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 not that. There is a. Jack of all trade, uh, master of none, or something like that. All right, something like that. Right, like that. So are you? I, I are was, you trying I to? Was, do... I'll prove them wrong. <laughs> yeah. So you, yeah, you want to prove them wrong? wrong. Mm -hmm. I, I want to prove that theory wrong because it, nobody is a master of anything. Okay. First off, if you're not if you're not God, you are not a master of anything. Okay. But you. You knowing that you have a God in you means that you can master something in you for you to portray for me to understand. So with that being said, I'm willing to... Oh, wow. Our internet. But um, you know how uh, we're talking... Uh, we, we, uh, I mean, we, we're bringing this uh, uh, feed all the way from Ghana. So we understand certain things will happen. But hey, we are still here having fun um, talking to Mo as we do. Uh, I'm sorry. Talking to Mo Mo Beat uh, Banga uh, and um, there is, uh, he actually came up with an amazing uh, 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 EP that we'll talk about it. But uh, we'll take a musical break when we come back. We will talk about. I mean, we, I mean, at that time, uh, I believe Mo Beat will be back, and then we'll talk more of the um, the EP. But before that, let's take a musical break, and we will see what next. <laughs>
to advertise with us, donate sponsorships and suggestions. Email us at trendafricatv at gmail.com or call us on 773-312-0318 or 773-756-6678. Remember to also follow and like us at Trend Africa TV on Facebook so you can always catch us live. On Instagram as Trend Africa TV 123 or subscribe to our YouTube channel as Trend Africa TV and click on the notification button to watch previous shows. You can also visit our website for your African news, entertainment, fashion and sports updates on www.trendafricaonline.net. Trend Africa TV, redefining Africa. Are you looking for photography service for your upcoming event? Is it a wedding, an engagement, or a special event? Look no further. Jojo Texan Images is here. Hire him today for great quality pictures, a quality service provided on the day, and a great personality. Jojo Texan Images is on social media. Follow him Instagram and Facebook at Jojo Texan Images or call him 312 450-5235 and book your appointments today. Jojo Texan Images. Simply, simply excellent. Book him now. What it do, my people? It's your boy Kingsley Ego B, aka King the Preacher, aka the Peacemaker, aka the Joy of the People. Is my peace of mind. You are now watching Trend Africa. Don't touch that dial. If you, eh, you won't touch her. Come on, you there. Keep watching Trend Africa. We are here. Africa has come to stay. Don't touch that dial. One love. Keep watching. Ratata. Baye, 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 kekelemi. Yo, Ghana, worldwide, Africa. This your boy King Jerry, the rhythm styler, Sankofa hitmaker. I watch Trend Africa TV. Watch Trend Africa TV every Wednesday with Black Jesus. Charlie, Trend Africa TV, the best online TV worldwide. Redeem style, bye. Hello, my name is Basiji. Keep liking our page, Trend Africa TV. Subscribe on YouTube, Trend Africa TV. Yes, we're back again having fun with this young man doing big things in Ghana. Oh man. So, uh, uh, what, what are you coming back to Chicago? Um, I'm waiting for my exit from uh, Trump. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and before we get to the EP, let's talk about the. Uh, I, 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 somebody sent me, uh, I, I mean, I saw that you are on the, um, on the list, uh, I mean, the virtual Ghana first. Uh, that right. is coming this Saturday. Um, I mean, is, is this your first time doing the virtual, uh, something like that? This is my second time doing the virtual. It's nice. Um, yeah. I think you have to create the energy that you intend to give to people, regardless if the people are there or not. So that's, that's another challenge for me. And even doing live is a whole different avenue for me because I've always been in the studio. I've always been the guy making the little, you know, directions and things like that. And now coming live is like, yo. But it's been fun. It's a nice experience. Nice experience, I'm right? Yeah. I mean, I, when, I, when I saw your name and um, um, a wifey name, I was like, okay, it's going to be hot. <clears throat> I can't yeah. wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. Okay. John Africa is representing. So, hey, I mean, mm -hmm. I mean, I, I believe that that day, I'll get one of uh, one of I mean a little uh, tick tock with you and uh, on, on that very day. I mean I'm, I know you can be very very busy, but I mean hey, it is what it is. Now let's talk about uh, the, the the EP. I mean why? I mean this is amazing. I, I listened to some of the songs and it's just uh, it's, it's just fire, and it's it's different. What 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 do you call your music? I mean what style what style do you do? I think. Uh... I would say 
banger. It's just me. It's a fusion of everything that it is. Of course, the base of my music is African. So I'm an African, like, like an African diaspora. So with that being said, it might go for Afrofusion. What I think is, is just banger. That's my genre. Whatever I produce is just banger. Whenever I hear it, you know, you say banger, you say Afrobeat. You just say, oh, Benga, this song is Benga, it's Benga. And that's it. Obeti. Obeti, bang, bang, <laughs> bang. <laughs> so tell us about this project, man. Tell us about this project. I mean, project. Uh, it, 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 uh, it has been a, a long a, a long time coming, you know? Mm -hmm. Tell us about mm -hmm. this. So this project is actually my debut, you know, EP. I've been doing a couple songs, but. All the songs I did were because I was a producer and I know what sound is out there now. So I can always make one and be a part of everything that is happening and not necessarily make a difference because I know I'm the producer. I can just jump into whatever I want, right? But I, I wanted to come out with a purpose. I wanted to come out with a meaning so much that it will be an entity when Mo Beats Banger, you say, okay, I know this guy for this, right? This type of music, or this type of music. But, you know, that, you know, Mo Beats is a producer, first off, but coming into like making music and lyrical content and, and giving people like a concept of what I'll have in my head or a, a type of sound or a type of story at a certain point in time, I had never like really, really put anything out there like that. So with that being said, I want to challenge myself to do that. And I've been planning to do an EP for the longest. I will say for the past five years is when I was like, you know what, I'm ready. I want to do it for myself. I want to do it to myself. I want to see how far I can take myself. You know, because obviously those journeys with other people that I produce for, but at the end of the day, I always feel like there's something there that always hits me and let me know that, yo, I'm here, what's up? You're looking at everybody else, you're not looking at me. I'm here, you know, so when I keep that to it, it kind of sort of came out, but not when I was expecting it. It came out. <laughs> I just destroyed a little bit. <laughs> I know, right? It came out when I was not expecting it at all. It came out um, during the corona. I think when what I did, or me and my team, what we did was we went back to basic. So going back to basic is getting back into yourself and finding your purpose, regardless of what has happened. Yeah, there's a lot of chaos going on, but if you have a purpose, it always narrows your way, and you you can you can focus. And with that being said, being home here in Ghana, I had I built a studio, so all I did was. We're in the studio every day, and if I feel like making the beat, I'll make it. And when I make the beat, I'll just have a melody in my head. And the melody will have some words to it. I'll, I'll, sometimes I'll just hum it, and sometimes I'll just write it. But it all came mm -hmm. by the grace of God, by grace So, you know, that was, I think, that was the effect, that was the effect of it. It was more work before, but I think when I immerse myself more into being spiritual and not religious, mm, I, mm, mm, I like that. Then I, I, I figured, okay, yes, there's a God power and you can tap into it, but you need a manual to it. And the manual is always the truth, because the truth is always straight. It's just like that. That's it's right. either that. And once you follow that, you know, or once I followed that, you know, I found myself and my purpose and what I'm really supposed to be doing. So I just followed through with that. And what happens is that everything just kept on going. Just keep dropping. But sometimes I just wake up and things happen. And you know, I'm I'm very grateful to God that all these things are happening. You know what I'm saying? Because before uh, I wouldn't, I was lost. As much as I was doing whatever. I was lost because I was doing everything out there, but 
what I'm really supposed to be doing, I wasn't doing it. And, you know, I think that's one good thing that, you know, um, being spiritual brought to me. And also, when the corona also came, it also helped it. Because being spiritual, I, I became more spiritual, I think, I'll say five years ago. And um, corona came and I had to find a purpose. Because, you know, it, there has to be chaos for you to have that sense of narrowing everything. Mm. And that's how it also came. Or maybe you say that uh, spiritual because five years ago when the wifey came in and then everything, I mean... Yeah, that, that also <laughs> adds up to it. That, that, that really also adds up to it. Right? Mm. That is how... I think it was there. Yeah. But I needed a wake-up call. And your wake-up call always has to be the person who will tell you what you're doing is not what it's supposed to be. Like yeah. The person is not even in that sense. You need a real person so that you get the exact reflection of what you are doing. Because mm. a lot of people will fake it because they want to fake it for you, you know. But some people will just tell you as a tip, whether yeah. you like it or not, yeah. you know. And others are like that because of how disciplined they are with their spirituality, right? Right. So with that being said, I also learned or I also got more interested in in, in getting more of that and more into myself and all of that things. So yeah, she played a part in it. A major part, basically. Major because part. It, it, made, it made every other thing work. Mm. You know? So, Big up to the wife. Know. I mean, I, I can't wait to yeah. have her on, on, on my platform so that we can yeah. we can rub some we can rub some shoulders, man. I, I love her so much. She's she's just an amazing young lady. I mean when I met her when you guys came, I mean last year, is it last like somewhere last year? And uh, yeah. we, we, we didn't get time to, I mean, you guys were busy and things like that. Me and my woman mm -hmm. trying to link up so that we can we can work some things out, but it never happened. But hey, there's more time to come, you know? I mean, we, we're still yeah. alive, so we, we, it, it will happen. It will happen one of the days, you know? But um, let me play one of your, 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 your songs. It says Deja Vu. And then um, after after we finish playing, then you tell us what, you know, this Deja because I've watched the movie Deja Vu before. So is it the same type of story? Hey, movie is here to tell us. So, you know what, guys? When you come on the page, make sure you share the page. Man, let this be viral, man, for real. Because this is the first time I'm having the original. I mean, the guy who made it in Chicago. The guy who started from the closet. Remember that? Yep. To win mm -hmm. award in Ghana. I mean, it never yeah. happened. You know, this is just a blessing. So let's listen to uh, Deja Vu. Get it. Who bet they bang bang bang? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I wanna flex now. Bang, I want to vex now. You could do you like deja vu. My money long now. Yeah, you wanna flex now. Yeah, I want to flex now. Bang, you could do you like deja vu. My money long now. I wanna flex now. Bang, I want to vex now. You could do you like deja vu. My money long now. You wanna flex now? Yeah, I want to flex now. Bang up. Do you like deja vu? Bling, my money bling, bling, long bling, bling, now. So many restrictions. Now my inner is vicious. I think complicated. Now they wanna get with it. But got in the journey. When my son wasn't worthy. They had to have it. To the masses that heard it. Now how you gonna inspire? When they try hard to fire. But you only stay inspired. When they stay very conspired. I wanna flex now, bang, I want to vex now. You could do you like deja vu, my money long now. Yeah, you wanna flex now, yeah, I want to flex now, bang, you could do you like deja vu, my money long now. I wanna flex now, bang, I want to vex now. You could do you like deja vu, my money long now. Yeah, you wanna flex now, yeah, I want to flex now. Bang, do you like deja vu? My money long me and my team. Me yeah, my team. That kind of things we want to do. A share your dream. A share your dream. Where have you been? Where have you been? Corona locked the old world down, but we get big. We still get big. Bang. I wanna flex you, mad. In a me coupe galado. Why they look like that? Oh, you do your people about nice. So 
Yeah, I say we your hobby bow. Why you dey me like this? I say we your freestyle. Why you dey panic like this? Yeah, I wanna flex now. Bang, All right, to flex. let's 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 go, man. see, yes, I mean, yes. tell us, tell us about. I mean, listen. They are doing. Yeah. Okay, so let me start with the title. Mm. The title of Deja Vu is just because track one. Everybody knows it's track one. Yeah. And what I'm about to do, you have seen it before. It's nothing different. But if you open your heart to listen to it, mm. you hear something. I'm just letting you know that you have heard music before. It might be of a certain caliber, a certain genre. Let's say hip hop. That's me giving you a Deja Vu of what you're heard. Now, I'm still giving you a deja vu of you hearing um, P on a hip hop song. Right. Right? right? Which has already been done. But I'm still giving you another one. It's a deja vu, but it might be different. Regardless, like you said, in the movie, whenever he came, he came back, he changed something. Mm. Right? But that's what makes it interesting for you to, to find out why. Yeah, why, why? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So, I, I like well, the layout of this music. I, um, um, listen, yeah. uh, who is the wonderful voice? That, I mean, who? who? Oh, so coming to it. So okay, okay, I, okay, I, I, <laughs> I, 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 I had my brother, my brother Emo, Chop Red. Emo, you know Emo, Chuck, right? Emo, my young brother. Emo, yeah, Emo okay. Chop Red. So he produced the the, the beat, the, the track, right? He produced it. Wow. And then he sent it to me. And he's like, yo, listen to it. Let me know what you feel. And I listen to him like, yo, I like it. I think if you change a little bit of this, he's like, all right, cool, I'll do it. Right then, then he, he changed it, sent it back to me. And I'm like, all right, cool. Now, he had no idea what I was about to do. He sends me a couple beats, but sometimes I'll do it when I feel like it. Because if I'm not feeling it, I don't want to do and spoil it just because I have to do something for it. So he's also understanding. He um, sends a beat over, I do my verse. And then I add another verse to it. But this verse was just, it was something different to change it. Mm. Something different to give you a different feel of, of that type of music that nobody's doing right now. You have heard that type of, you know, stuff over there. But nobody really pays attention to those things now. Like, you know how they had um, Missy Ellis on hip-hop track, and you want to listen to it because she sounds nice on the hip-hop track. Yeah, you know? yeah. yeah. That's yeah. Not Two music, I feature two music on the track. Ah, and she did she body the song. Yeah, man, she body the song. She, she did she, well, she man. She body the she, song she just, for me. She just rubbed you know? it in. Oh, she just, <laughs> she just rubbed it in. Like you said, she just rubbed it in. And she understood exactly what I was saying. But she is more like a deep poet, right? The lyrics are deeper than just the melodies. They are nice melodies, but what she's saying is deep, and people can really relate to it. And I was excited and happy that I let her do that because it explained the, the, the track in a certain way that I also thought that people should catch it in that matter. You know what I'm saying? Right. So yeah, that's how, that's, that's how we did it, and it was fun. It took two hours to record the song. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> So, you know, why is it that, I mean, I was thinking that maybe we'll get some video coming out, and I mean, this is amazing. I mean, I know the LP, a lot of people drop LP with video. Why Why won't you do that? Oh, I want, to, I want them to hear it. You know, I want people to hear it and have a feel of what they think that they will see, because I want to surprise them. Sometimes it's nice to drop with a video. It's okay. It gives you the momentum, whatever it is. Mm. I want my music to marinate the people who are going to listen to it. You have to get the vibe. Now, when you get the vibe, I give you a visual. And you will get it from a different standpoint. Because I want you to feel like you got it. Yes, you got it. But it could be in this way, too. Have you thought about it? That's but it still at the same time. That's so that means that every, every day is a new yeah. thing. But it's, it's, you know it's, it's mean? pointing to the same thing. But you, you, yeah, you got no idea about it. <laughs> <laughs> that yeah. is Morbid Banger for That's you, man. We just it. So, Moby, when did you drop this? Last, it's someone last week, right? Oh, two weeks ago. Two weeks ago, actually. Two weeks ago. Two weeks How ago. is it going? How is it going? 
I, was I, was I had a couple interviews at uh, YFM and had one interview for, uh, in Takari, but the the uh, report, not the report, the presenter came all the way to Accra to come to my studio to do it. So I'll be sharing all these um, interviews online on my Instagram as well. So nice. whenever you guys do you know, have a recap of whatever happened, so go check it out. And I'm, I'm blessed to have you to, to talk about the same. I mean, I'm, I'm rubbing shoulders with the big guys over there. So that's a good thing. That's a good thing. Bless up. Um, 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 let's do let's do the track two. Uh, it says uh, it's a time, right? Mm -hmm. let, let's do track two. Um, All right. Get up, stand up, baby, give me vibe. Hold up, go up, never be my life. Forever, hold I love you in my life and my afterlife. Any time of the day, any time of the day, yeah. night time, say, if I go day. Baby, do I'm on my knee, 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 Fashionista, baby, when you style up, everybody in the world say your body badder. Party starter, when I put the light up. Ooh, yeah. Caramel girl, where you find so? Minya Wanka, how would I know? See, early morning kisses me vibes, vibes. Any time of the day, any time of the day, yeah. night time, say, if I go day. Baby, do I'm on my knee, oh, on my knee, oh, who be swan? What's up, Bill the Banga? Ty, tell me, Ty, man. I, I, I think my, uh, I've, I've listened to like three of you know, this, this story. No, I didn't listen to everything. But uh, I think Ty, Ty is what really did the thing for me. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Ty, Ty cool. is what did the thing. So, Ty, man. Time was. Time came right in time. <laughs> <laughs> Time was produced by Time was produced by Arrow. Arrow is a friend, it's a brother, you know. Um Arrow hit me up on SoundCloud like, yo, I like your song. You know the song Bana. What be your name I say Bana? Yeah. Bana. Yeah, he hit me up like, yo, I like that song. I like to do something with you. I'm like, cool. Send me something. And then he sends me a little beat. And I'm like, yo, you know the producer. Why are you sending me play to beats like that? You know? And he's like, oh, check it out. Whichever one, I mean, whichever one you want, you know, that's it. I'm like, cool. I listened to a couple, but this track, this beat just caught my attention, and the lyrics were just flowing. And the lyrics were more of me expressing to my significant other that I'm going to be here throughout everything. It doesn't really matter what happens, you know what I'm saying? But even if it, it, it gets hard or whatnot, we should, you know, push ourselves to the extent that haters go ball, you know, but at the same time, when you flip the song, I'm talking to my fans and people who listen to me that it doesn't matter what happened. I'm still going to be here and I'm going to work with you guys and I'm going to love you guys to the end because it's you guys. So it's, it's basically a two in one song. You can listen to it anyhow. A female can listen to it and feel like, oh, he's talking to me. A fan might listen to it and be like, damn, he's really saying that he's going to be here for a long time or till whatever time, you know what I'm saying? So that's the, you know, the impression on the song. And, you know, I was I was glad about the outcome of the song, you know, and I just sent it to him and he also loved it. 
to hate. I think it's a beautiful exactly. song. There's a lot of people. Let me let me give some shout outs real quick and then I, will, I mean there's a lot of your fans out there. Yeah, yeah, I mean yeah, we have yeah. Susan, we have um uh Empress Mousy, we have yeah. um Jonathan, we have Avram Ben Moshe, um mm -hmm. we, we have um uh do, 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 do. Yasmin. Um, yeah, we have Benjamin. We have, we have Yomi. Yeah, we have Kofi. <laughs> we have yep. um, uh, PK. Um, Benjamin. Shut up. Shut up, shut up. I shut mean, up, shut the up. names keep on popping and stuff like that, you know? Uh, yep. That's how popular you are. You, you're doing a big. We have Emo. That I think yep. that's, your, that's your boy. I mean, that's my boy. That's my boy. Yes, sir. Um, yeah. I, love, I, I, I like that young man. He's a very respectful young man. So, yeah. big up to yourself, doing well, doing good. So, where would, I mean, this, uh, I mean, do they have it all over? I mean, all the uh, musical platforms? Yeah. On all musical platforms, digital musical platforms, um, iTunes, Tidal, Spotify, and also, it's on my website, goodmobibenga.com. M O B E A T Z B A N G R dot com. So when you go to mobit.com, mobit, yeah, mobit, uh, what? Mobitbanger.com. Mobitbanger.com, you can buy that, you can purchase it from there, and then also it's all over the it's music platforms. Hey, go it. check it out because, man, this is this is a hit. This song, I mean, every you you will not throw one away. All of them is a banger, and I'm gonna play. Hey, you guys got lucky. I mean, I have all the tunes. I'm gonna give you a low, you know, teaser. We're not gonna play everything because you have to go buy it. <laughs> because me myself, I buy my own, my own. I buy my own. <laughs> you understand? <laughs> so, <laughs> so we're gonna give you a low teaser here and there, and talk more about uh, maybe what is coming next and things like that. And I mean, the new project. I mean, the whole good stuff about him and. You know, sometimes I'll, I'll, I'll fuse in with a little bad stuff because I hear a little bad stuff here and there. But hey, the most important thing is that we have the EP on every platform. Go check yeah. it out. It's amazing. Bye -bye. Let's move to the party. Yeah. Um, is it what? Uh, pretty, right? Pretty. With the, oh, man. Black Up is on it, too. Oh, my God. I, this is, this is going to be fire. So let's listen to that one. <laughs> Let's talk about this one, man. This is this is this is this, man. 
Three out of three, good. I love it. Three out of three. That's that's what's up. I like that. I like that. You know, uh, black, black cop, black cop, black cop, black cop. Man, that dude, man. That dude is, is, is something else, man. That dude is something else. I do, right? So black, you know, black is family, man. I, I, I can do an EP and not involve black, mm. you know, because black inspires me a lot. I know he knows that. I sometimes do like you know, see, but yeah, he inspires me a lot because he does not hold back. You know, black will just go at it because he he knows that after today, I'll be judged, right? Mm. So I might as well just put in my all than just do anything. Black will be one of the people that any day, any time, you tell him, say, you want to do something now. He give you his best. Yeah. And it's always timeless. It doesn't matter when you play. It's always timeless. You yeah. know, that's one thing I like about him. One thing that I also learned from him. Um, that, this song that, was produced that, by Shank. Shank is a Nigerian producer and artist too. He listen. He, he, he moved to Chicago a couple months ago and moved back to Indiana, but he comes back. You know, he's a great friend and all that. I hit him up, say, I'm doing my EP and I'll need an instrumental. And he's like, yo, I got you. Just sent it. I did my thing. And I sent this to Black Up. But you know what? Black Up says is uh, Corona, so he can't get up to go and record. Mm. And Black Up says, Black Up says, we'll go. Is so what a, happens? I'm like, is that we'll go record? You know, I'm come out. Because <laughs> it's Corona. When he get out, he's not coming back. And I have to understand it, you know? So, 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 so how how you get them to go 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 do them? Right. So we have to we have to improvise. We have to think so deep to improvise, right? And I'm like, hold on. You have an iPhone? He's like, yes. I'm like, okay, cool. Download this app, right? But he's like, okay, I have an iPad. I'm like, okay, cool. Get your iPad, download this app, and then record the vocal with your iPhone while you are playing the song on your iPad in your Bluetooth speaker, right? Then I'll get the vocal. So he sent, he recorded on a, on a, uh, with an iPhone. I sent it to him. And I mixed it and I put it in the, in the beat. Wow. Yeah. And that's how efficient it was. Like, that's how, like, that's how much he will go to make the job done. That's how much we will push to make sure that we are doing it. It doesn't matter what is happening mm. in the world. We still have to push it. We still have to find a way to make things work. And we did, you know, and I played the song to the producer and he loved it. He's like, yo, this song is mad, bro. I'm like, yeah. And shout out to uh, DJ Slim. So DJ Slim is the one who introduced me to him last year. Yeah, a year last month. Yeah. Talk about DJ, DJ Slim Slim Chicago? Yeah, DJ Slim Chicago. Okay. He introduced me to Sean, you know, big shout out to DJ Slim. He's another brother from another mother. You know, he's on his thing too. Shout out to the Unstoppable Nation, you know. But yeah, he's the one introduced me, and you know, Black Up blessed the track for me. So it's only wise that you know, I put it number three, Trinity. Three of three. That's <laughs> three of three. I mean, I, I, it's, it's good. But um, I, I want us to talk a little bit. You and Black Up, you guys have gone a long way. I mean, um, yeah. the last time I interviewed both of you, and you know, when I was actually on the radio. Um, you guys said something that really uh, is really inspiring. I mean, you know, you, 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 I mean, you said every time you, you, you drop a beat, normally, normally you have to listen to the, uh, uh, what do you call it? The chorus. I mean, you said something. I mean, you have to listen to the, uh, the, chorus. the chorus and then uh, before you make the beat. But for you, you just... With black up, you don't you don't want to listen to any chorus. You just do the beat and just do something, and then that put yeah. on. I mean, that's the challenge for him to yeah. to, to to do something, and uh, that that makes you feel like you have to do more because you want to challenge him that he cannot do anything that you put on. Yeah, the beat. always challenge each other. Right, right, right. From the right. first, from the first day I met him, we have been challenging each other. So, mm. so I mean. <laughs> You and Black, uh, Black Cup is more like, um, and then I have, I have, I, 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 there, there is something that two years ago or three years ago, I mean, you guys decided not to uh, uh, climb uh, Ghana first, or is it Black Cup did that? I mean, there is some 
revolution or something. Right, right, I mean, right. right. What, what happened? What, what, what? <laughs> okay, I, I, I'm I'm happy that you know we are going to speak on it. Um, it was it was all for a positive cause because like like we are discussing now, mm. we have been at making music for a long time. Right. It's not more than since the ten years in Chicago again, right? So with that being said, we have been there and we understand that music as a career has to some way, somehow, tend for you or give you some anything, whatever it might be. Right. Now, I think when the call comes that we need you or we want you to come and perform at Ghana Fest, we also look at it as you are talking to artists, not your friend. Right. If you want us to support in a certain way, you support to be supported. Mm. Get it. You don't have to. I'm not. I don't have to be rigid, or you don't have to lowball me. You know, but I think sometimes it look like that because we are here, and then sometimes they will get artists from Ghana to come and perform. That's nice, and they get paid for it. Mm. As much as you guys understand that. This is a paid gig. Why are we not getting the same? Okay, let's say in another scenario, they see it as we are giving you a platform for you to perform. Right. That's okay. But at the same time, after you gave me that platform that first time or whatnot, I've been building my fan base. Whenever you call me back on your platform, I'm coming with my fan base. Mm. But that being compensation only makes the matter smooth. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. It makes me feel like what I'm doing, you see it as a career. You see it as something positive that, you know, has to earn it, like earn something. Just like you also earn when you are done organizing the event. Whichever way it is, you earn something. Whether it be money or earning the respect, it's something you want to earn. Right. So I believe that, that sometimes the approach is like, okay, we want you guys to do it and we are giving you a platform. That's okay. Some people will take the platform. Some people will, will see past just the platform because they know what they have. Everybody has value. So you are inviting my value to gain more value. But what value are you putting on me? Mm. Because once we accept that we wanted it for free, right? I mean, we wanted to do it for the support. Now, it became a redundant thing every year. Everybody else wanted to do it. It didn't matter what it is. You know what I'm saying? But if other artists count, right, this will happen. They are treated like VIP. Mm. They get to be in the shell, in the little things. Well, it's not shell, but little tents and things, right? Right. We get to be standing around with our friends because we are cool. So it's time. And I have an, a little issue. Last time I was on Ghana Fair, mm. I was disrespectful, and I didn't like it. Say it, say it right here. Say it. Yes, I didn't like it, and I expressed it on the stage, because one thing my dad taught me was, do not let uh, anything, morning, pass your anger talk. That's right. I like so that. So when you offend me, I'll respectfully respond, mm. and respectfully let you understand that I get it. This is you, your whole entity. But you are crossing a line that you don't know what can happen on this side. So with that being said, it wasn't right. Do not get me to be ready to come on stage and I get there and then you tell me, oh, they want somebody else to perform. So if, uh, no, the time I'm supposed to perform, right? Somebody was supposed to perform and they were not there. Now I get there and I'm like, I'll do it anyway. Regardless, you put me first or second, I'll do it. And then, this man, I forgot his name, but he used to be an actor in Ghana. We all know you as an actor in Ghana. That's cool. You moved to Chicago. You have a whole family. I respect that. You have made whatever name for you. But remember that the same way you were putting in work in Ghana to become a, a great actor, it's the same way I am also putting time and work into what I want to become in future. That's right. Now, in this future, you are not the actor anymore. You're an organizer on a stage. 
Mm. So why are you blocking my time to shine? It makes no sense to me. That's right. Because I have respected you as an as an actor, right? And the pioneer. I don't know how many I don't know how many people know that you're an actor. Right. That I, I don't know. But I respect just because I saw you. I gave you a lot of respect. But you didn't respect my artistry. When I got there, you said, "If you're not going to do it, then go home." How do you tell me that? Mm. It makes no. Did you? 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 Right there, I told him you don't get to tell me that I should go home because I don't. You don't put me on the show for free, right? right? And then I bring my fans to come and patronize what you guys are doing, right? Right. And after that, when I get there and everybody's ready to see me, you deprive me of getting on the stage. Mm -hmm. And then you tell me that if me, yeah, I make coffee because you look at me as a kid. And that is very petty. Mm -hmm. and, and, very I, 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 like, I like the fact that you, you were able to uh, 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 voice it out right there. But yeah. uh, did you send your consent to uh, the, the council? That's all. If you don't want to respect you, however you show me, I will show you the same thing back. But with respect, I might tell you something you might not like. But it's just the truth because it's going to hurt you for a long time. Mm -hmm. How would you feel if it was your kid on that stage and they were being treated like that? You'd be home feeling bitter because you look at yourself that I've been, I've, I've been acting for a long time. So that alone should put my, my kids on a pedestal. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. But that being said, do you know my dad? No, you don't. You don't know what, you, you, don't, you don't even try to research about the people you are bringing or let the people you are paying. Mm -hmm. But the people who are supporting to make the thing happen, you treat them like, you know, excuse me, say, okay, I'll use it. You treat them like they are nothing. You know what I'm saying? And it's bad. And you have to resist what they're like, like that. that. I'm so glad that uh, today has been the day that you are voicing this out. Because we, I mean, for yeah. me, I, I don't know. Because you know I love entertainment. And, 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 they can call me to whatever music they need. And I'll tell them that. It doesn't matter who they bring. Mm. It doesn't matter. Mm. It wouldn't matter. And I'll tell them about themselves every time. Because there's one thing about we Africans in the diaspora that that we we have this this attitude of someone who yeah something like I call it new because for you're younger and <laughs> oh yeah but that's not my fault that God has blessed me to have that type of intellect. No, the only thing I can do is respect. So why do you disrespect me to get to get like a reaction out of me? Just right. so that you can let people know that I told you so. It makes no sense. Right. <laughs> so, okay. so, so Mommy, did you actually uh, report this to the council? I mean, and the um, likes of the, the parquises and then the unis and all those. Uh, I mean, because the, the reason I'm saying this, you, you still, I mean, your, your respect level is high. That is why we didn't hear about this. I mean, if it, it should be another person, it's going to be you know, you know what I mean. So mm -hmm. um, I feel like people like you that have, 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 I mean, your brand and the way you, you are respected in the community, you should have, uh, you should have taken a step a little bit further to talk to, um, uh, uh, I mean, the team and said, listen, this is not right, so that they can. I mean, I respect you for for not even. I mean, if I, I want you to do it. But at the same time, I respect you for letting sleeping dogs, you know, like whatever the, the saying is. Yeah, yeah, then, yeah. But still, the fact that you are, they, they called you for this virtual concert and you are still doing it is, is, is a plus. I mean, that puts you, your respect yeah. level to another level. But I believe that right. from now, you should let them know that, hey, listen, this is not right. Okay. With, with that being said, right, I'm very happy you're saying that. Um, what they have to know is that the artists that are going to be on there sometimes need support, but they might not know how to express it to these people, right? Because of the way you guys approach them. And that's what I want to talk to Ghana Natasha about. Apart from that, if you come at me personally, I can come back at you because I'm a man. At this point, if anything happens, I get to be judged as an adult. If I can go to the source, I'm not about to go and voice out to everybody saying, I don't have the time. I'm going to tell you in your face, it's going to hurt you. But once it's done, when the people around you, because I know that when it happened, there were people around me. Oh, Pato, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm the mom, that. And yeah, you ask them. I said, so, what's the main channel? 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 So, what's the main chann
And I believe they're not going to do to anybody else. Even when they see me today, they will understand it. And I did this for Ghana, Ghana Fest because it's, it's a company, right? It's Ghana National Council. It's always going to be there. I'm not that petty to say, because they have done that, I'll boycott and tell everybody not to come and do it. No, that would be just childish of me. No, mm. I'm going to do it. It's a platform that is, has been harnessed for a long time. And it's a good platform. I'm not going to say, no. But if there are bad nuts in there, you have to go at the nuts. Don't go at, yeah. at all the people. Yeah. So I will come as a mess because I have companies, I have business, and I understand what it is. Mm. So I'm not about to come and act like a kid. If I, if, if, now, when that happened, no. Now, I remember when, at, at, at your um, interview, when I was there with Blackout, they walked in, one of them walked in. Now, that was the same person that I saw outside at Ghana Fest. That same day I was about to go and perform. Now, Black Jesus, mm. imagine, I get there, and you know they have another gate where you have tickets and things like that. Right. As a performance artist, I'm supposed to have complimentary tickets for the show that I'm bringing. Mm. I don't want tickets for my friends. Because I'm coming to give you a show. I have people on stage, dancers, dancers with me. I came there with three people. You told me that I get to get my one ticket for myself and one ticket for one person. And the rest got to pay. Wow. Come on, man. Come on. Wow. This, it doesn't make sense to me, but you know what I did? I'm like, you know what? Once we are here, we'll do it anyway. I kept telling this guy, please, yo, let's get this shit, like, sorry, let's get this thing done the right way because I don't want to spaz out outside here for you guys to now come and realize that you are wrong. I told him, I told him a couple of times and he gave me one more extra ticket. And I was like, all right, cool. And I gave it to whoever, I paid extra and we all got in. I closed my mind to it. Till I saw him that day, right? And I told you, and I told him in his face, that like, you are the one who didn't give me the ticket. And he's like, oh no, yeah, they come with it. Like, what, you were there. So this is me. I am that guy. I feel like if there's an issue and a lot of people, have access to the issue. Whenever you hear it, it's different sides to it. I will tell you myself. That will be cut off the max and say, yeah, you know it's not me. Yeah. And that's the problem. Yeah. Yeah. So with that being said, what I want Ghana National Council to understand is that we, we have, we, we, we applaud them for their, what they're doing and we have a lot of respect for them and we want them to reciprocate the same respect to us. You know what I'm saying? In mm-hmm. sense that when artists come and we are on your bill, at least get two things. How much is a tent? Think about it. One thing for the artists that you guys want to, you know, put on the top, that's cool. They have been working hard, so they have to get that tent. But the other tent is for us, so that sometimes we also go there and we also know who and who I and who and who. I mean, I, I think that's a, I mean, that's a very yeah, good thing. It's like, um, it's yeah. the exclusiveness of the Ghana Fest. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Next time, the kids that are coming to Ghana Fest are the same people who are going to carry on with this thing. Yeah. Now, when you come on with it and they come and it's the same thing happening, that's when you know it looks like there's drama everywhere. Drama, but everything is about understanding that's and it. knowing what you're doing. It's not just about the business part. If you want to do show, you have to get somebody who knows that side to, yeah. to control that side, tell you get so that it will be nice and be, you know, as beautiful as possible on that end as well, you know. That's true. So, I mean, you, you, you've, made, you've made your point, and I believe that the council yeah. is, I mean, there's a lot of people who are actually uh, watching, they, they are in, I mean, they are part of the council, so they'll take this note and they'll, they'll make their, I mean, they'll, they'll correct some, some, certain things. I mean, this is a, a, a well, well point making. I mean, you've done well. Um, yeah. let, let's, I know your, 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 your temperature is just... Whoop. <laughs> oh no no! This actually me like if I'm passionate about what I'm saying, right? I have to have the emotion because I don't know how to fake it. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. regardless of the thing, it's not me angry. I cannot get angry, or I wouldn't even exert that type of energy to that. But no, no, I want no, to no, make no, it, no, it, no, it, it was something that you act, and I I know that we didn't talk about it then, but now that it has come, I'd rather clear it and let them understand. Yeah. We are going to be here for a long time. Whatever anybody do, yeah. but. We have to do things in a certain way that it will make everybody feel comfortable in the tent. And that's basically it. And that's it, yeah. So we're going to take a musical break. I mean, uh, Movit is still here. We have about, I mean, there's about four to three songs that I'm going to play. And then, hey, go buy the EP all over. I mean, it's all over um, uh, 
you know uh, all the musical uh, uh, platforms is there go download it uh it's not that much i paid mine so go pay yours and uh let's make you happy let's support this young man i mean he's bringing a lot of good music out i mean dancing music feel good music sit back music chilled music everything banger has that in that very ep so let's go support him let's go buy it go to um um up and whatever uh musical platform that you know and he's there i mean the ep is there. just type in banger uh more uh, uh, more beat banger and then you uh, you will uh, get the the, the the whole um songs over there but we'll take a musical break when we come back we'll dive in more and listen to more of the songs and also talk more about the next project that he actually working on now I believe that he's coming he wanted to come to Chicago to make some big thing I just I just you know I'm saying I mean come I mean I mean can oh no I'm saying I mean come I mean there's a, there's a, there's a big concert coming man I, you guys <laughs> stay tuned man boy shout <laughs> I'm representing right now for Trend Africa TV, your number one online TV ever. Watch Trend Africa TV live on Facebook this and every Wednesday at 4.30 p.m. Ghana time and 11.30 a.m. Chicago time with your one and only Royal Black Jesus. I'm a sister, bless her. Glenn, my sister, I'm going to show you how to this. The go M1, I mean this, we love Royal Black Jesus too much. We live in Chicago. If you want to see him, follow him on Facebook. Then the African TV and say Black Jesus. Man, I'm bad. I'm telling you, I'm not good too much. In Chicago, they love him too much. So, want to follow him on Facebook. Then the Africa TV and check Black Jesus. Man, I'm bad and to realize no matter what I want, we have music, we have a ear. Papa wrote the one, they message of Black Jesus. Long, long, so tired. Baby, to win him some of favor. My fist I see fee man. Ebi I know you be. What's up? This be your chocho mucho bless and you're live on Trend Africa. Keep watching it. Blessing the microphone, blessing your ears. Moonlight loving. This is Akonefa. I'm a singer songwriter and you're watching Trend Africa TV. What's up, people? We are back again with the amazing Mo Beat Banger. Hey, like I said, when you come on the page, make sure you share the page. We are having fun. We are enjoying the moment. We are creating some moment right now. I mean, this is going to go far. I know what I mean. So when you come on the page, make sure you share the page and be, be part of history because this is the first time we are having a wonderful young man with, with huge, 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 I mean, the respect I have for this man is just amazing. I mean, you know, with um, he's a very down to head. I mean, man, Moby, tell me about your humbleness a little bit before we get to your your. I mean, the, uh, the rest of the music. I mean, what you get those? Uh, you're too humble, man. <laughs> That's it, right? Just for me, and Moby. Yeah. That's it. They are cool. <laughs> They are cool. I think it's their 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 way of life. It's so that I've, I've yeah. learned that's why they're cool, but they know what they are about or what they they want. Yeah, I met so, your mom and I, 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 I did met your dad before, and um, I, I yes, they they amazing. I, I, and you know what? The funny thing is, I didn't know that your mom speak Ghana. Who? I didn't know that your mom can speak Ghana actually. My mom. Yeah. What? I didn't. That she was. 
I mean, Let's dive in and yeah. listen to some of the, uh, more of the um, more of the tunes. Uh, uh, let's see, Where, where's my my my, my thing? Track, I think track track four. Track four, uh, right? GD. Hey. Yeah. Uh, 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 track four, GD. Hold on, Two. hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm on side one. Oh man. We lie. All right, Bobby, tell us a little bit about track four. Track four, yeah. GD. Um, Produced by Saz, Saz on the beat. Produced by Saz. Um, I'm on this track with Sue. On, the, on, on this track, um, they're talking more about our confidence in ourselves now. You know, earlier on, I was talking about spirituality and how you have to get back into yourself to you know who you are and know your purpose. So that being said, this song is um, our, our self-confidence that we want people to be able to channel and also find themselves, hopefully. So listen to the track. It was played by Saad. It's dope. It's dope. It was amazing. We recorded it in the studio whilst recording it. Which is funny because we were just humming to it on the, on the iPhone and just recording that. And then we were like, you know what? Let's just do it. And we just did it. Wow. So um, GD. And GD means belief. You know, so... I hope you believe in the song and it might give you some type of confidence in yourself. So let's go. Yeah. Tra 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 track four. Let's do track four. I'm a Rose's joint. Bang. 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 I said, man, no one me and tell me good that did it. Yeah. I'm grinding for good deep. When nobody saw my dreams, I kept on pushing. I'm never quitting. Bro, you know, 
Open door. Open door. Open door. <laughs> if you're a DJ and you don't have this in your collection, after people are love it tipsy, man. This is what they want to move with. For real. Man, people are saying we should, I should play one more time. Okay, I'll do it one more time. Um, um, let's do this for them. Say it again. And then let's do it for them. Yeah, we'll That's everybody. everybody we'll, do we'll do it one more time. We'll do it one more time. Yeah. Let's do it one more time, people. Mess up. Like I said, when you come on the page, make sure you share the page. Um, uh, Eunice have come around, uh, the uh, the business manager, and then, then yep. she actually have said certain things there. Um, I mean, thank you for sharing your experience. So, I mean, I don't want to read, you know, I don't want to read about it and things like that. But I believe that she she's saying that, you know, you, I mean, I know, I know they'll work out, they'll work on our because of time. I don't want to read uh, comments, but um, uh, let's do it one more time for the fans. This is uh, uh Moby, I, I please uh, introduce, I mean, give us the music, introduce the music for us so that we can do it one more time. So, this song is titled Diddy, you know, which means believe in my language, G. Um, Hey, no, believe it's English, sorry. So GD is my language G and believe it's the English language. <laughs> but, you know, fast forward, um, this song features two, and we did that thing. We did Afrobeat Tuesday, some so, new so, school. No, 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 I'm, I'm so mad right now. Why is it that I'm not seeing Sue right now? Like, I have to, you have to see Sue right there sitting with you so that I can see that. It is like it. And then uh, you I, I, I'm, I'm gonna ask you, why are you coming on my platform? I mean, I know you have the, <laughs> the, 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 the you have you rough shoulders with the likes of uh, uh, Pat Thomas, Kojun Cheese, and all these big boys, but I want uh, my platform. Yeah, with Sammy Kuti too. And She's Sammy the only Ghanaian, the only Ghanaian, the only Ghanaian female who has performed with Sammy Kuti on stage. Wow. This is not. Wow. So, if anybody else, I, I, I'm, I'm, so, I'm so mad right now. Like, why is it that me? Come on, man. She have to be on this platform with me. I don't know when, but that we we go. Uh, listen, we gotta work, work something out. So this is GD again. Uh, yeah. Special request to all the fans who are, are asking for GD. I mean, I mean, I'm dancing my, you know, my behind. You know what I mean? This is GD when you're a little bit tipsy, and then this music is on with your girl. Oh my goodness! Let's do it one more time. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Bang. 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 Man, 
bit. This is this is hate, man. I like this. I like I like I like I like I like this. This is this is good. This is this is good. Um, four out of four, man. Four out of four. Mm -hmm. That is amazing. I mean, I'm loving it. Let's do number five. And it's five is lit. Let's do it. Let's do it. Chicago, are you having oh. fun? I hope you're having fun. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. God damn, we lead you. Come, we hit you. Fresh out the kitchen. You know. Call the police, you lead it. Them boys are lead you. Come, we hit you. Fresh out the kitchen. You know. Call the police, you lead it. Fresh out the kitchen. You know. Call the police, you lead it. The matter got the formula. To make the hit on the regular yeah. Making the girl them go gaga ga, ga. Blowing them on the medulla Mmm, forget, forget Bad man go confess Mmm, forget No man can contest Come test me I go chop you like my Betty Indo me your super get it Eventually you might regret it My friend forget it God damn we lead you Call me we hit you Fresh out the kitchen you know. Call the police, you did de 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 Them boys are lit, you Call me, we hit you Fresh out the kitchen, you Call the police, you did de de Fresh out the kitchen, you did de Call the police, you did de de Call the police, you did de de C'est que nous sommes On peut jamais oublier qui nous sommes On sort comme un feu qui nous sauve we the cook it up, they deserving it. We the work hard, we deserving it. Bought it up, earning it. I got hella bodies at the door, and they cannot get in cause it's full. I got girls who came just for the balls. I got girls trying to call the balls. Call me when he hits you. Fresh out that kitchen. All right, moment. Uh, uh, tell us about this lit, man. Tell us about it. And who is on it? This song is special. It's special. This song is uh, produced by me, thank you. Um, and also, <laughs> Kimar. Kimar is my... I mean, the line is breaking now. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you now, yeah. Can you hear me now? Okay. I said this song was produced by me. That's my friend, my G from um coming together. We wanted to create a fusion of Ghanaian music and Francophone music because he's French, you know. So with that being said, if you listen to the instrumentation, it's right type of sound. But at the same time, so. Some of the sounds that I'm using are played with the same pattern as, um, let's say, um, Afrobeat or Francophone music. But the sounds are not a, a Francophone sound. Right. Not too Francophone, but the pattern are like that. So it gives you a different sound. And, you know, when you were asking me about the way I make my beat and why I started making beats like that. So I like to fuse everything that is around me. So it's more like a lifestyle when you hear my music. It's like, right. you know it's me. Nobody will tell you that. So that being said, he did that and he blessed me on it. Shout out to T Mart. You know, he's in Chicago too. You guys should check him out. He's an amazing artist as well. You know, we had fun making the song actually. So, you know, so well, you never him. had um feature anybody from Ghana or anything? Um okay. not yet. I I, I, I want I wanted to make music with people around me like i want people to understand my environment before be around me or i want to do or before even taking myself outside of the contest or because Ghanaians have a way of making their music they make their music in a certain way i do mine in a certain way but i believe that what intrigues Ghanaians to want to make a song with jay-z me or somebody else is the way they make music with Right. They are community type of people. So now when you hear me with my guys friends too, 
you can fit yourself where you feel like you can fit yourself and you can start working. So with that being said, I wanted to come out as a diaspora and not necessarily a Ghanaian, okay. you know, and putting them on the song. It's cool, I'll do that. But I just wanted to make that environment known before I indulge myself in that. So, so that's why I didn't get no um, Ghanaian features yet. But expect that. I'm doing a lot. I'm going to do a lot with them. Right. And even people outside of Ghana. Yeah, that's so beautiful. I, 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 I just listened to the cover. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to play all the um, uh, the songs. I, I want them to go buy the rest. I mean, buy and then listen to the rest, and then they'll, they'll feel. I mean, when you have you have a copy, you know that yeah, you, you are, you're supporting the brother, and at the same time you you are part of history. You know what I mean? So uh, let I go support uh, mm -hmm. a whole bit, uh, uh, Banga and. Um, with this project, this, this, I mean, you, 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 I know you've put too much money, so much money in there to let it look good like that. Uh, we are, we, we are looking forward for the videos. I mean, that'll be another chapter of the game. Um, so, um, how, mm -hmm. how, 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 how much is the, um, the CD? I mean, uh, I mean, the, the songs, the album. I think. Oh, with, with the CD, I think the, the, the album is for free. I want everybody to have it for free because I want you guys to know me. If I want you to know me, I don't want to sell myself to you. I just know me. Now, in knowing me, if you want to support me, if you check the link, the, go to mobeatsbanger.com and hit the link. and you come down, there's some buttons there. You know, you can support. Anything that you feel like, okay, I like this guy's music, I like whatever, I want to support. Yeah, you can do that. So you basically, so the music basically is free, free, but you can support the It's free, but if I'm supporting some way, it will obviously be, you know, but I, I want it to be free. It's, it's free from right. me, but it's sold in other places too as well. You know, but when I start doing shows, so far as there's been money pumped into making a show, obviously we have to find a, a way to uh, monetize things and make sure that they make something back and turn back. So that will be where sometimes the things, the, 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 the funding will come in. Nice. So, but now it's free. I want everybody else to hear it and hear me and hear the other you know, amazing talent that I work with, be it the producers, be it the, the nice vocalists, be it the rappers, be whoever is on it. I want everybody else to just get to know it because there's more coming. Nice one. Which I, yeah. <laughs> nice one. Nice yeah. one. I mean, that's, yeah. that's, a, that's a way to open the door. I mean, you, you've already mm -hmm. opened the door. This is just a gift for the fans, you know. Right, so, right, I mean, right. you can still support by going to the website and then, yeah. you know, if you, if you feel like this is, a, you know, this is something, you know, if you feel like you want to help a brother, just uh, hit on the links and things like that. And then, you know, we will, we will definitely appreciate what you, uh, uh, you've done for, you know, the, 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 the movement, the movement. And so, um, a bit, um, what, what is in the pipeline? I mean, we have about next, um, 20 minutes to wrap, maybe 15, 20 minutes to wrap the show up. Um, uh, what do you have in the pipeline coming apart from this, uh, project? Hello, Moby, can you hear me? So we lost Moby for a minute. I mean, he will come back in a in few time. Uh, you guys should hold on. Um, you know, there's more to talk about. Let's take some few uh, commercial break and then uh, we will go from, um, from there. Um, uh, let's see what we have here. Um, let's go. Are you looking for photography service for your upcoming event? Is it a wedding, an engagement, or a special event? Look no further. Joga Texan Images is here. Hire him today for great quality pictures, a quality service provided on the day, and a great personality. Georgia Texan Images is on social media. Follow him Instagram and Facebook at Georgia Texan Images or call him 312 450-5235 and book your appointments today. Georgia Texan Images. Simply, simply excellent. Book him now. Wild one, wild one, people of the world. I go by the name Mafia, aka Young Bass. I'm representing right now for Trend Africa TV, your number one online TV ever. Watch Trend Africa TV live on Facebook this and every Wednesday at 4.30 p.m. Ghana time and 11.30 a.m. Chicago time with your one and only Royal Black Jesus. I'm a Cecil. Bless her.
Hi, my name is Ochiame Kwame, the rap dancer. Coronavirus is a stubborn one. And because of this small virus, the whole world is on lockdown. But hey, hope is not lost. When you need a doctor, you mustn't go anywhere. All you have to do is to call mobile doctors. They will send a doctor to your home, send a phleb to come and take your blood sample. I will authorize the pharmacist to bring the medication to your home. Don't go anywhere. Mobile doctors will bring everything to you wherever you are. If you are looking for a discount, just call and give them this code, OKMD, and they'll give you an amazing discount. Mobile doctors is my choice, and I recommend it for you. For more information, log on to www.mobiledoctors.net. Yo, my name is Hans Vex. You're watching me live on Trend Africa TV. Keep it locked. Oh, yeah. Ha <laughs> ha. All right, we are back again with the one and only, the pop daddy of our time, <laughs> Moby the Banger. Tally, boss, Tally, you did, you did all, man. I mean, it's, it's, it's just a, I mean, I, I, I'm, uh, uh, you're just an amazing guy to talk to like when it comes to music i mean everything about music you 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 are you are the um uh let me say the sort of it i mean you, you without you we, we we cannot take a step in here in chicago for real that one that and this is what i mean 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 Hey, I don't they hear you. I hope uh, um, they can hear you from a um, yeah. We, we we cannot hear you. So let's take a, a quick uh, commercial break again, and then when we come back, we will. Um, I believe uh, Moby to fix the um, the system and then we'll bring him back on. So we'll take a quick commercial break and uh, we will see if everything is fine at his end. Um, yeah. So one one good commercial where we can hear him. Yes. They said they cannot hear you, Moby. So work some magic for me, and then um, we'll go from there. Nice one, nice one. Moby is back. 
So mommy, let's 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 try and wrap this up in the, in the, in the next five ten minutes. Two more um, songs. So two more songs, right? Yeah. And then we go, right? Let's do the two more songs. I, I think I have one more. Um, that mommy. Yeah, I'm listening to you. I'm trying to get yep. the other song and uh, hey. It's called Bono. That be, I see some. Oh, that's a trailer. Bono, Bono. Let me see. Let me look. Yeah. For, let me look for Bono. Bono, Bono. Oh yeah, Bono. I see. Yeah. Bono, yeah. Yeah. So Bono is like a visionary. All the time, when you need me on the line, I'll be busy day and night. He be said, I keep you in the dark, outside my plans, and I know you die. You got feelings, I know that. I got duties, you know that. I can't leave you when you know that, so don't say that. Me bell sao, don't worry. I know they see nobody falling. Baby, please, I'm sorry. I'm just chasing all this money. Me bell sao, don't worry. I know they see nobody falling. Sorry, I'm just chasing all this money. Girl, you know something, I never meant to hurt you. You can't go now. Girl, you know something, I never go to vex you. You can't go now. Girl, you know something, I never meant to hurt you. You can't go now. Girl, you know something, I never go to vex you. You can't go now. Oh yeah, look to the left, look to the right. All the girl, let me be my type. Don't be the best. Give you child happiness, give me time, I'm gonna give all of my babies. I bet someone said I'm cheating, right? All this toxic got you chipping, but me bell sao, don't worry. I know they see nobody falling. Baby, please, I'm sorry. I'm just chasing all this money. Me bell sao, don't worry. I know they see nobody falling. Baby, please, I'm sorry. I'm just chasing all this money. Girl, you know something, I never meant to hurt you. You can't for now. Me, you never go to vaccine. Kelly, not so me, I never meant to hurt you. Kelly, not so me, I never go to vaccine. So don't do that, so don't do that Girl, you know something, you never meant to hurt you You can't go now Girl, you know something, you never go to vex you You can't go now Girl, you know something, you never meant to hurt you You can't go now Girl, you know something, you never go to vex you You can't go now Girl, you know something, you never meant to hurt you You can't go now Girl, you know something, you never go to vex you You can't go now Girl, you know, say I no go feel hurt you in Kebo. No, but no. Charlie, that's a good, good song. This is for like the wifey type, and you, you know, you know let them the know. It. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you know this, 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 this song there? It go for my woman, Empress Mouse. Mm. I, 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 I dedicate this song for him. You know, thank you. Go change the paper. You know what I mean? So, yeah, man. Let me the paper. If I know saying but no, when you look left and right, nobody day, man. Nobody day. I mean, if you for listen to the song and understand some something, I mean, right. the words and, right, right. and then enjoy the music, you know that, you know. And I, I was listening. Produced, it was produced by um, yeah. Visionary B. It's a group of producers, but the key producer for this was Kwame Jeff. You know, shout out to Kwame Jeff. Shout out to Visionary B. Yo, they did their thing on this beat, and um, I put my vocals to it. They heard it. They loved it. And you know, we dropped that track six. Wow. And it's good. You know? That's beautiful. And which was the next track? I think that's it, right? Next track is True Baller. You know? Um, I believe that in like in, in, in everybody's life. Hey, you never said that true baller. Hey. Hey, that's the get time. 
Like, and then he's like, get that, get that, get that, get that. Yeah. <laughs> so I, I think that in everybody's life, there, there comes a time where there's an up and down movement in your life or whatnot. But there's right. always that time right. that you did unnecessary things because you're feeling that you're supposed to do it because you're the guy or whatnot. I've lived my part. I've lived my, my end of it um, a little bit. And I think my little advice that I want to give to people who are behind me or whoever has an open mind to listen, you know, this is my advice to them. And, you know, it's like, it's like my two cents. You don't have to take it. You still have your 98 cents. You know what I'm saying? But my two cents is going to make the dollar. So, hey, you might as well listen to it. Right, <laughs> right, right, right. Right. So yeah. let's listen to True Baller. True Baller. It'd be like... Or $2. $2. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go, Chicago. I hope you guys are having fun. We're just enjoying this moment. And um, please, support the brother. Go on the website and support. It's on all the musical platforms. And go and download and support the brother. Let's do it. Hey. hey! Oh, you guys are on the stage at the stage. We didn't give you more speech. More speech. <laughs> I 
can't show them. Because I don't really show them the I know. this day. I understand. I know. <laughs> I hey, no, 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 no. Talk about dance before uh-huh. you run. Uh-huh. You are the number one dance now. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Please, yeah. I'm busy. I'm busy. No, no, no. no. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. You know who told me about? Ooh. You. But my mom, my mom's like, ah, ah. I brought dinner so fast, you're fast, man. Nice. Oh, so fast. Oh. And I'm sorry, I'm sorry. The one day you go back, no way. I think it was a editorial and it's in a month. Like, oh, you, 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 Oh, where is this, bro? Where is it now? Oh, my God. Yeah, that's it. It's mean, funny, my mean, My woman, my woman to the dance rope. I mean, I think, I think the true ball, I know, we will, we will, we will, we will represent. I mean, me and my woman. Yeah. We will come with a different style, crap. I mean, one style. Come give like, them from home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That be the we'll day we go shoot for Chicago here, yeah, no. We we'll go shoot for Chicago here, yeah, no. One time, we'll yeah. Let's yeah, make it happen. Yeah. 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 I think the two yeah. footballer be. I be that be the first one where I hear. Oh, you sent me before. Right. Yeah. Right. Right. Where I right. hear, where I say, damn, this is good. This is good. I mean, I yeah. like the yeah. call and respond. It's more than some. Yeah. 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 So, Moby, you, like, you 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 working on coming to Chicago for a big something? I don't you want I don't know if you want to put it out there or we should just let it let it let it let it, let it lie low for a minute. Okay, I'll I'll just say I think the fans will expect something from me very soon. Mm-hmm. Um, hopefully, um, the borders are open. That way, I I really want to announce what I want to do. But all all I want everybody else to know is just keep. Keep you keep an open mind, keep an open eye. Yes. I'll do something nice for yeah. you people in other places too. Black Jesus knows it, but if Trump doesn't open the border, yeah. Black Jesus will tell us. So unless, <laughs> unless, unless, unless let Trump open it, then Black Jesus will tell you guys. So with that being said, yeah. just expect something big coming up. You know, uh, Trend Africa is going to be supporting it. You know, Ghana National Council is going to support it. Yes. Um, the cool people all are going to support it, yeah. and other Ghanaians from other states who are going to support it. You know, and so I, I, even now with this, what you are thinking of uh, all these uh, people that you actually uh, came yeah. up with, I mean, the likes of the Mo SB Dog, Black Cup, all right. these. Uh, uh, and yeah. and I, I, I can't wait to see um, uh, 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 Cambodia coming back. That's a reunion right there. That's a reunion right there. Oh my goodness. Cambodia has to get it. I'm planning he's to do it on the Snapchat and his WhatsApp. When you open his WhatsApp, you'll see him. Yeah. Yeah. But he I'm, got I'm, it. I'm, he I'm knows planning, it. I'm planning, I'm planning to shock him one of these days. You know, he'll you should, be, you I'll be knocking on the door. I'll be like, you know, I'm, I'm, you're, you're on Trend Africa. Right? Let's talk. To. Let's talk. From, nah, nah. Yeah, nah, nah, nah. 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 Put some respect on it. Put some respect on it. You know, anytime I'm performing, yeah. I'm performing with Chris, and I'm performing with Julius. Yeah, Julius. You know, shout out to them both. They always support me regardless. It doesn't matter what time I call them. Yo, yeah. they are always. You guys should expect them to. They are always a part of it. Yeah. You know, everybody. I don't want to see. Like Julius, I let you tell them what I'm going to do. No, okay. we, don't want, we don't want to tell them. We don't. We'll, tell we'll, them. Keep, we'll keep it for the next time. I mean. <laughs> But big up to Julius, uh, African yep. African Kings, right? African, yeah, and then Priest. African Kings. Priest. Yeah. Yep. Priest. Is that Prince? Oh, Prince, Prince, Prince. The, the, yeah, the, right. the, the, the dreadlocks, yes, yes, they're Prince, yes. So big up to all of these guys, and um, let's make it happen. I mean, I, 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 oh, I'll shock them one of these days. When the, I mean, when we have time to move around more, I'll, I'll be shocking them, you know. I'll just know, I'll find out where they live, and then I'll just go on and out and be like, "Hey, you're on Trend Africa. Let's talk," you know, things like that. Because I know all these people are bringing a lot of energy. I mean, they're making the the the, the, the uh, Chicago look good. I mean, our, the Ghanaian community is looking great with all these young chap doing great things, dancing, music, uh, uh, Jashanti. Oh my God, Jashanti! Oh Lord, that guy have something, you know. And Moby, your your voice is off again. I mean, your your we can't hear you. We can't hear you. So yeah, but um, I'm, I'm, if you guys can hear me, we are wrapping the show up in a minute. So if Moby come, we will let him uh, give us uh, his last words and also and uh, and then that's it. So Moby, are you are you? Can you hear us now? I can. 
I, I still can't hear you. All right. So, um, people, hopefully Moby to come back and then we'll have about a minute to wrap this show up. If not that, we're just going to wrap it up. And um, like I said, let's support a brother. You know, uh, the uh, uh, EP is out there. All social media platform. I mean, all the social media platform. You can uh, follow him on uh, all the social media platform: Instagram, uh, Facebook, um, YouTube as well. It's Moby Banger, and also uh, follow Trend Africa TV on Facebook, YouTube, and uh, Instagram. Uh, it's Trend Africa. It's um, on social on Facebook. It's Trend Africa TV. Uh, for, uh, YouTube is Trend Africa TV. Uh, Instagram is Trend Africa TV. One two three. Uh, follow us, like, and subscribe to our channel because all these things you can go back and uh, revisit it and, 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 and it, 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 it to look like it's new. So, um, yeah, subscribe to our channel it's, uh, on YouTube. It's very, very important. Please, when you come, make sure you subscribe to our channel. It's called Trend Africa TV on YouTube so that we can bring you more videos like that. And tomorrow, we're going to have amazing, amazing young um uh, a musician as well all the way from ghana um i believe he lives in the waterland so we're gonna have uh um, this young man on board and we'll talk about him and his music we have more bit back so we'll let Moby give us his uh last words and we'll wrap the show up so Moby, if you are back on and you can hear us or we can hear you give us your last word so that we can let you go we know that bye, 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 bye. Is just bad Okay, I, I want to say a big thank you to you know, God Almighty for mm. making this happen and other days happening. Also, I want to say a big thank you to everybody who helped or who is involved in the EP and everything that I have done. I also want to say a big thank you to my team. I want to say a big thank you to everybody. Because if I name up, I have plenty of friends. They might be mad, but they know themselves. I want to say a big thank you to everybody who has been a part of my life. You know, big shout to um, True, big shout to Scratch, Yoma, Fahime. big shout out to my, 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 my brother, Benny Drill, big shout out to Sandra, you know, big shout out to Black Cup, Dashanti, Juju, Solomon, Moesby W, Uriah, Cambodia, Perkman Sizer, uh, Raising DJ Bonsu, DJ Bonsu, uh, Emil, Kofi Cimento, uh, Aviv. Look, everybody, man, I have a bunch of people in my head. I can't finish, but I want to say a big thing. No, don't everybody. forget, don't forget our rap king, Reason. Oh, yeah, oh, come back. <laughs> a big shout out to Reason, our, our, our entrepreneur, <laughs> cool artist, cool and director. Yes, you yes, know, uh, big shout rich, 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 rich entertainment. Big shout, you know, rich and cheap. You know, you guys can see more things happening. That's right. And uh, I, I want everybody else to be peaceful. You know, big shout out to the National Council. You know, I just did the, um, um, the, the, the virtual the concert. virtual concert. Yeah. And, and, and you know, for the record, whatever it was earlier is not anything to bash them or anything. It's just me expressing what I've been asked for some interview. If I never told you, you know. So whichever way it is, I understand from from um, the business lady's point of view, she didn't treat me like that. That's why I made it clear that it might be it, it, it's a business, right. it's, a, it's a community, right. right? But if there are bad nuts in there, mm. I would rather go at them, and that's what I did. So not necessarily putting that Ghana National Council is is bad or doesn't do that. I was just expressing my experience. Right. At a certain time. So, I, you know. I, I, I believe I understand. Do. I believe that they, 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 mm -hmm. it's well known. Black matter and all lives matter. You know, mm -hmm. God best and the rest will all work. So, let's, let's all be happy. And, you know, go on my website, www.mobizbanger.com. M-O-B-E-A-T-Z-B-A-N-G-R dot com. Show so now. Thank you very much, Trend Africa. Thank you very much, Black Jesus. No, 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 it's not just black Jesus, it's royal. Royal black ah, Jesus, I'm sorry. Thank you, thank you, much, 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 when you call me black Jesus, I, somebody, yeah. you know somebody stole that name. So, somebody stole know, my right? black Jesus, so I, I just let it go. I say, just take it. Yeah. 
Now, Royal Black yeah. Jesus, RBJ, you know, after the show. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And what they don't know is that one time when I had my new studio uh, on um, Peter, right. right? Like, I was looking for a place to buy a new laptop. I mean, a new computer, right? Right, right. And then right. I called oh, Leona Joy, and he's like, ah. I was so more. 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 And, you know, thank you for always being yourself and being a bigger brother, regardless of whatever happens, you know. Yes, you, you, you made it understand that it's not about good or it's not about, you know, it's all about the respect and the way you communicate with each other. It's, that's how we live. You know? Yes, sir. Yes, regardless of what happens, you know, there was always a center for all of us, you know. Yes, thank you for being Thank you. I mean, thank, thank you. you. I mean, uh, hey, inspiration comes from both ways. So, hey, I learned from you, you learn from me, and that's what it is, man. Respect doesn't, you know, goes one way. It goes both ways. So, if I plant it in you, you grow out of it and, and then and showers me with it. So, it's a blessing. It's a blessing to have you respect me and I respect you back. And uh, I respect everybody, you know. I mean, you know me. The young ones, the, who, I, who? I don't know. But uh, Roy I'm, I'm, I'm Roy I, I, the, the, the only thing I'm praying that one of these days all of you guys will come together like that and then let's do it one more time i mean let's do it one it's more coming. time it's you coming know, it's coming right i believe, coming. I believe that all right coming. i believe that big up to yourself brother thank you so much for honoring this invitation and giving that like, i mean it's a blessing to actually uh showing me love for what i do i mean respect for uh respect my my craft and respect my platform uh, you came up, you, you know, blessed me with your LP. Let's talk about, I mean, uh, 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 the EP, we talk about it and things like that. It's a blessing. It's, it, I mean, I, I, I really cherish it. I mean, it's a moment. So, you know, keep doing what you're doing. I mean, the sky is the limit. I know you, I mean, you, you, you go more than that. I mean, so bless up. And I hope that with this very uh, interview or this very conversation that we have or this very... Uh, a uh, packet that we just did to sell to the public, uh, it will go far and people will call you all over. And guess what? Grammys yeah, is yeah, coming. Yeah. Grammys is around the corner. So, yeah, hey, yeah, we can't wait. We can't wait. We can't wait. Oh, all right, okay. <laughs> Bless up and give uh, 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 greetings to the, 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 uh, the, the queen for me. Yeah. Yeah. And the queen. Oh, yeah. Yes, yes, queen, yes, queen, queen, too. Yes, I'll yes. do that. Yeah, do that. And then tell, tell Queen that I can't wait to have him. I have her on, on, on board. I mean, yeah, it's easy. It's man, easy. I have so much for her, and then I can't wait. I'm going to lash her. Come on. <laughs> All right, man. God bless you. Bye-bye for now. Bye-bye.